Let me ask you something. Would you inhale nicotine, antifreeze, metal particles and flavored chemicals directly into your lung through a sleek USB stick? That's exactly what millions of teen and adults are doing every single day. It's called vaping. And today on the doctor's couch, we are learning on what's really inside the cloud of so-called harmless vapor. Vaping is marketed as safe alternative to smoking. But as a physician, I can tell you it is not safe. So what exactly is vaping? It's the use of an electronic cigarette or device to heat a liquid called e-liquid or vape juice, which typically contains nicotine, propylene glycol and glycerin. Yes, the same stuff found in antifreeze, artificial flavoring chemicals and sometimes even TSC, heavy metals or synthetic drugs. This liquid turns into an aerosol, not water vapor, but a fine chemical mist that travels straight into your lungs and directly into your bloodstream. Now here's who is getting addicted. According to CDC, over 2.5 million middle and high school students in the US are already vaping. And guess what? These devices are deliberately flavored with cotton candy, mango and bubblegum because the target is the youth. Even adults who try vaping to quit smoking often end up just switching addictions, not overcoming them. And it gets worse. Unlike traditional cigarettes, vapes are barely regulated. Some deliver even more nicotine than the entire pack of cigarettes. And most users have no idea how much they are actually inhaling. Let's talk health risk. We are seeing popcorn lung, a permanent lung condition from inhaling a flavoring chemical called as diacetyl. Evali, a serious lung condition sometimes caused by vitamin E acetate and TSC vapes. Increased risk of asthma, heart disease, depression and cognitive decline especially in teens and in some cases even sudden death from the complete lung collapse. So while big vape sells you the dream of a clean smokeless high, the truth is it's a chemical time bomb and it's going off one puff at a time. In the series of next episode, we are breaking down it all. The science of nicotine addiction, the mental health cost, and what parents, schools, and physicians can do to fight back. Because this isn't just about vaping, it's about the health of the entire generation.